Hey guys, welcome to the PD Theme widget tutorial. In today's video, we'll go over the details of the WooCircle Gallery widget by Prime Slider add-on for Elementor. Let's drag and drop WooCircle inside Elementor editor page. What you see is the default interface of the widget. Clicking the fancy looking arrowheads changes the slides with some engaging transitions. From the options, the first scroll bar here lets you change the total height of the items. You can adjust it to fit inside the landing page. With the image size option, dimensions of all images within the display can be changed. The switchers below can show or hide specific elements on display while toggled, such as title, excerpt, price, and add to cart. From the query section, you may select the source of the displayed products and set the display limit. Then comes the include exclude fields for specifying the displayed items by categories, tags, authors, or power item names. Jumping into the style part. Within the first section, the item subsection lets you change the circle color behind the images. That circle is the main attraction point for this widget. Then switch to the title subsection and here you can change the title color, stroke, shadow, typography, and margin. Then the price part. Here, old and sell price customizations are separated so you can tune them easily. The open icon visible at the bottom right of the circle is customizable through the last subsection here. Let's pick a color for the background along with the configuring colors for hover. Check that out quickly. Then comes the model section. Here, first thing is to customize the model title. Then the price colors. Let's open the model and customize it in real time. The close button can be customized in the same way as the open button. Then scroll down below and change the colors of the add to cart button. Don't forget the hover settings here. The quantity counter comes with color, border, padding, shadow and typography options that you can customize. Lastly, let's change the navigation arrow color and hover color with a customized arrow size. Good. Now have a look at the finished interface, your customers are going to love this. That's all for this video, please like, share and subscribe to this channel to receive updates on new tutorials. Stay safe and see you next time.